What's up guys? Welcome to episode 4 of Duke's Outfitters. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a leather money clip wallet out of Hippo. I'm super excited about it, so if you just stay tuned, I'll let you check it out. You know the West Coast is back for all you suckers. Suckers! So put something in it. Put it in Alright, so from here on out, I'm going to be a set of talking hands. Um, the first step that you do is trace your template out onto your material. I've already traced it onto here. Got to trace it onto the suede here, and we're going to cut out some RFID blocking material so my client's information will not get stolen. So let's get started. Nice little pockets. Oh, it's gonna be so cool. Okay, so the next step is to glue everything together. Um, this is the fastest way to mess your project up. This glue is obviously very sticky and if it gets on anything it's not coming off. So just be very careful and I will show you how this goes together. So first get your side with the pockets cut in it. Put that face down and you want to trace the border of this and you only want to go no more than about half an inch with this glue and don't go too crazy less is kind of more in this situation Clean your surface one more time, put some weights on it. Okay, so while that's drying, I would just like to ask you guys to do me a quick favor and go hit that like and that subscribe button down below this video. Um, the more likes and subscribers that I have, the more recognized I get on YouTube and it just kind of helps me be successful with getting more exposure out on the internet and just more recognition in general. So, yep, go like and subscribe this and let's go back and check out this wallet. Alrighty. It's all glued up. Glue's dry. Just got to trim a little bit off the edges there, clean it up, punch holes in it, stitch it up, and we'll be just about done.
Okay, so somehow the file got corrupted whenever I punched all the holes in the wallet. So unfortunately, there's no footage here of me actually doing that. But basically, all you do is you get the punch and you just run the punch about a quarter of an inch away from the edge all the way around until you complete the entire perimeter of the wallet. So carry on. Alrighty, stitching's done, looks good. Still gotta burn these little tags off. All right. So I think I'm done for the night. I'm tired and I'm gonna finish editing the footage I've already gotten. Um, but I'm going to leave this here with these weights on top of it. That will keep the fold and then I will punch the holes tomorrow and install the money clip and this one will be shipping out on Monday. Alrighty and good morning. As you can see it is now the next day. We have a couple of more things to show you. Um, I have already laid out my line here to put my stitch and so I got to punch these holes and then I'm going to teach y'all how to burnish the edges <clears throat> so to put this stitch on to use this money clip here you have to what you need to do is you need to crease this this bridge here and you need to come 13 millimeters back and you mark 13 millimeters back all the way across or all the way down this bridge and that is the line that you punch all the way down to uh, to get your holes to get the the right size it's just kind of a trick of learned um, it's just a good way to get it right so we're gonna do that real quick and then I will stitch it up and it'll be done Okay, holes are stitched, or holes are punched, ready to stitch.
Okay. So it's important to use. Oh, oopsies. It's important to use a regular needle for this last bit. So I had to use a regular needle here to tie into this this existing stitch from the first round. And you're gonna have to do the same thing here. And the reason you can't do that is because this thing has a hook on it. And so when there's an existing stitch and you go in and you go to pull back out, you almost always mess up the previous string. Um, so don't mess your project up. Use regular needle here. Some money clip, kind of like a gunmetal gray sort of color. Goes in the bottom here. That got it. she is a hippo and suede money clip wallet <clears throat> well that's it thank you so much for watching guys once again if you liked this video please like subscribe and if you really liked it share your video share it to Facebook send it to your friends whatever just anything to get me out there also if you liked this wallet and you want one and you don't want to make it yourself I have a plethora of materials you can use I've got uh, this is kangaroo this is shark skin cowhide Wildebeest, another shark, um, and, and many more. So just get a hold of me on here or Instagram at dukes.outfitters or on Etsy. Just look up Dukes Outfitters pretty much on any platform and look for this face. All right, guys, thank you so much, and I will catch you all next time when I make a handle for this knife. Thank you so much, and catch you later. Till the wheels fall off. Hold up, wait. Oh my, to be acting too bold. Take a seat. Hope you're ready for the next episode. Hey.